This is what I believe. And of the sons of Issachar. Now please lend me your attention and let's do some two or three minutes prayer and then we're done. The first prayer is a repetition of a prayer that you prayed earlier on. That God will grant you the grace to discern the prophetic seasons you are in and the seasons that are about to unfold for you. And then you may also want to add that the Lord will grant you access to the strategy. I repeat the strategy again for the season. Lord, what do I need to do? When the wise man came to Jesus, the rich young ruler, he said, good master, what do I need to do to be saved? He knew as a rich young ruler that there was always a strategy for victory. Lord, what is the strategy you are bringing for my victory? Please open your mouth and begin to pray. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Let it be from the depth of your heart. Begin to pray. One minute. Pray. The strategy that is allocated for my dominion in this season, I obtain grace. The strategy that is allocated for my dominion in this season, I obtain grace. Hallelujah. We're going to take the last prayer point and as always, as a responsible apostolic and prophetic ministry, we're going to pray for Nigeria. I gave you a prophetic word last week and I told you, you have handed over this nation to God. I want you to relax. If you don't trust yourself, trust God. Are we together now? We are going to pray for this nation. We must raise our voices and decree and declare that in the name of Jesus, the counsel of the Lord will stand and we are going to speak over the election that is coming and decree and declare there will be no bloodshed, loss of lives and that God will arise in his power and see that his purposes are established upon our nation. Lift your voice and pray. Pray passionately and responsibly as a believer. Someone is praying. Passionately and responsibly. Shabrakete beleko sata frandas kabelech. Empra kata parakos kadevres kabelech. Shabrateke parakatos kavrende kabeleko siata. Manda prata fas kadabalakatos safrete kabeletos. Your mercy speaks over our land. In the name of Jesus, we decree and declare that you must be a manifestation of God's prophetic agenda. In the name of Jesus, the Son of the living God, we prophesy over the elections coming. Father, we pray that you protect and preserve your people. In the name of Jesus, let there be no bloodshed by the power of the Holy Ghost. Preserve your people by the power of the Holy Spirit. And Lord, we pray for our dear nation, let your purposes and your purposes alone stand. Let your purposes and your purposes alone be birthed. In the name of Jesus, we thwart every plan and every counsel of the wicked. In the name of Jesus, we pray for we pray for the law enforcement agencies. And we pray in the name of Jesus Christ for the judiciary, especially the Supreme Court. Lord, grant grace. By the power of the Holy Spirit, your counsel for this land stands. Your counsel for stands. Your counsel for the 36 states stand. Your counsel for the six geopolitical zones stand. In the name of Jesus, Satan, you have lost it over our nation. You have no power to enforce any agenda of darkness. It is the purpose of God for that stands. In the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, as we wrap up, let me speak over your life. I believe in the power of the prophetic. I believe in its ability to program a climate of spiritual possibilities. And it is the assignment of the prophetic and even priesthood to speak and declare over God's people. It's important to receive the blessing with all your heart. These are not mere speakings of a man's word. It is as inspired by the Holy Spirit. I want to speak over everyone here. 
the arrows of bloodshed the arrows of bloodshed over you and over your loved ones we command it returns back to hell no one no one under the sound of my voice will be a victim of bloodshed number two everybody connected to you by physical descent or by responsibility for your sake i declare that they are supernaturally preserved in the name of jesus i pray over your finances in the name of jesus the son of the living god i cry by god that this night may help arise for you from his sanctuary may help arise for you from his sanctuary you will not beg in the name of jesus god will use men god will use systems to make for your supplies number four i decree and declare that even in this season hear me koinonia nothing dies in your hand nothing dies in your hands in the mighty name of jesus if there is anybody here appointed unto death that there is any manifestation of a curse or any manipulation of the spirit of death that in the realm of the spirit they've concluded over you or your children whether through the elections or any other means i knock on the door of death and i command it to be far from you far from your habitation hallelujah every time there is famine every time there is economic and political turbulence one of the mysteries in the kingdom that preserves god god's people is favor can i speak over your life in the name of jesus the son of the living god you belong to a family that has been marvelously helped by god i pray experience favor i pray for you experience favor experience favor favor from the north favor from the south favor from the east favor from the west